In this video, I'll use the ID Automation barcode generator for Crystal Reports to encode a TLV in Base64 for QR code. The native generator for Crystal Reports is an easy to use product designed to generate barcodes using source code and a system font. TLV, type length value or tag length value, is an encoding design used for optional informational elements in a particular protocol. Type is the binary code that indicates the type of field that the message represents. Length is the size of the value field. Value is the variable size series of bytes which contains data for part of the message. The implementation is compatible with Zotka, Saudi, Sakat, and KSAE invoicing. In a future video, I'll explain the TLV process in greater detail. For now, the focus is TLV in Base64 using text data. The video assumes the native barcode generator for Crystal Reports QR code is downloaded, extracted, and a sample file is opened. The sample report contains a barcode with code behind, which is accessed through the formula editor. For this example, I'll use a string literal as my data. To start a TLV string, enter the pipe character and then the string. The formula automatically encodes TLV values in base64. Enter additional pipe characters to separate string values. Save and close. I'll scan the barcode with the ID Automation Data Decoder app. The scanner displays the output in Base64, and it also reveals the Base64 decode. And we can also see the property settings for the QR code. To encode TLV without Base64 encoding, enter the caret and pipe characters before the first value. Enter additional pipe characters to separate string values. To encode data as Base64 without TLV, use the equal symbol. In this video, I used the ID Automation barcode generator for Crystal Reports to encode a TLV in Base64 for QR code. I defined TLV as tag length value designed to encode data for several standards, including Zatka and KSAE invoicing. And I used the ID Automation barcode data decoder to scan and view the output. For more ID Automation barcode content, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.